What's up guys, Black Hole Zero and welcome back to another video and today we're back for the first stage of the Presidential Cycling Tour of Turkey 2019 on Pro Cycling Manager. Um, we have the 2019 uh, road thanks to Emre uh, who's a stage maker from Turkey and uh, he kindly made this for the World TV links in the description as always. I'm using the version 3.01, uh, so the version just after the Ronde van Vlaanderen. There might be one uh, following Paris-Roubaix. I'm recording this uh, literally like 20 minutes after Philippe Gilbert won it. Um, but yeah, enough talking. We've got six stages, one mountain stage, uh, which is going to be the queen stage of the tour. The first one is between Istanbul and Tekeda. Uh, I think I'm pronouncing it correctly, like Teke Tekeda. I think it's something like that. I could be wrong. Um, but we're going to go with this, and the team we're going to use is going to be Delco Marseille. Uh, we have Edouard Michel Grozu and Delio Fernandez as the two leaders of the team. Um, Mauro Fineto, uh, Ramones Navardoskas, Javier Moreno, Luca De Rossi, and Remy Rocha uh, will be uh, our lineup for this race. Um, leader wise, we've got De Kenank with two big sprinters Sam Bennett is there for Bora, Cavendish is there for Dimension Data, Caleb Ewan is there for Lotus Soudal, so it's going to be tough to beat them. And um, for the mountain, except from Ben O'Connor, there isn't really someone massive like Mihawi Kudus and Philippe Skorschartner, if you really want to argue. But uh, I think we can have a, a slight chance. So we're going to go ahead and hopefully uh, we can do something good with uh, Delco Marseille. And the 2019 Tour of Turkey is on its way. We are in the European part of Istanbul. Um, and uh, we're going to do some kilometers in Europe before going uh, to Asia for the rest of the week. First stage, as I said, between Istanbul and Turkey, 160 kilometers roughly, um, with a, a finish prone to a sprint and uh, a battle between Caleb Ewan, Sam Bennett, and um, a rider, well, the sprinter that will be chosen from a uh, Dukan quick Quickstep, either Alvaro Hudge or uh, Fabio Jakobsen. We've got uh, our lineup today that's not in a good day. Uh, Grozu is on the minus one, we've got uh, Navardowskas on the minus two. So I don't really know. Hopefully, like our leader uh, Fernandez will be on a good day tomorrow. Well, in five days, technically. Um, but we're gonna send someone in the breakaway. We're gonna send Remy Rocha, uh, trying to take some points maybe for the KUM jersey. That would be nice. That would be a nice thing to uh, to get for the team. We're followed by the uh, Pau. I think it's Moreno de Pau, or I could be wrong. From uh, Top Sport Vlanderen, uh, Van Empel from uh, Neri Sotoli and uh, Soto from Karaural. But uh, we're going to stop pacing in the peloton. We've got the Romanian champion uh, with Eduard uh, Grozu. That's always cool. Uh, not something you see uh, usually. You've got John Murphy who attacked for uh, Rally Cycling, the former BMC rider, followed by Kenny de Ketteler from Top Sport Vlanderen. And the peloton is probably going to let them go. This Pierre uh, André Cote, who's trying to follow them, uh, don't really know why, knowing that he's the sprinter of his team and he's got Murphy in the break. Surprising um, strategy here by the uh, by the Canadian sprinter. sprinter sorry. Um, but the peloton seems to have stopped, so we've got, as I said, a s five men, soon to be six, breakaway. And um, yeah, the aim, take the KOM points with Remy Rocha and then uh, try to do well in the sprint. Right, so the, we've never had an actual massive gap with uh, the peloton. The KOM is located not at the summit of the climb. What are you on about? That is very dumb. Uh, we're gonna pace until uh, the KOM with Remy Rocha. One kilometer. We've got the Turkish airline uh, banner here, and there we go, attacks by uh, Moreno de Pau, Van Empel, Soto. Let's go. Here's Remy Rocha's time. Go on. Can he get any points? He probably won't. He's going to get third place. That's one point for uh, for our rider. We've got a 2 minute 20 lead over a peloton led by uh, W52. And uh, I think that's Manzana Postobon. Alright. Disappointing uh, first climb for Remy. But hopefully... Uh, I don't know if I'll still be in the break uh, near the end. Because that's only 10 kilometers before the finish. And the peloton will have probably co us uh, by the time. Alright, so sit rep. Uh, we've been co by the peloton and like there's been just attacks by always three teams. Um, Top Sport Vlanderen, Karahural and uh, Neri Sotoli. They just keep on attacking. 
and I don't understand why. Cause like I'm gonna tr I'm gonna try to see if it still works. If I attack with Remy Rocha, they're gonna let me go, aren't they? No, they're not. Look, their whole team, their whole team is following me. There's three Neri, there's four Kaoral. I just I don't get it. It's so weird. Uh, but Remy Rocha is about to die, so we're gonna have him chill in the peloton. Um, I don't think. Should I make a? I'm gonna try to make a move with another guy. Uh, De Rossi. Is he gonna be followed as well? Caroral, Neri Sotoli, casual. Top spot Vlanderen and Rally Cycling. There we go. There's I don't know I don't know. The AI is being very weird uh, in this race. So I, I don't really know what to expect uh, right now. All right. So we're at the bottom of the Tech that climb uh, a small hill, just uh, before the finish line. About 14 kilometers remaining now in the stage. Um, we're pacing with Javier Moreno, we've made a train, um, I don't really know if it's worth making a train. Why is Grosu this far behind? Okay, Moreno, you're gonna stop pacing, because you don't have your leader in your wheel, which is exactly not what I wanted. Uh, where's Grosu? Come back. I swear to god. Rochas is being blocked, uh, because the Ducanon Quickstep is pacing with Davide Martinelli. Alright, Grosu is back in the bo back in business. Uh, so we can pace with Javi Moreno, Navardo Cas, Fineto, Grozu, Delio Fernandez. Alright, Fernandez being our GC leader, I just don't want him to be caught in any form of incident. Yakoventa uh, takes the mountain points. Uh, Rémi Rocha, you can now stop because you're of no use. Oh, actually, there's a bit of a break. There is a bit of a break here. Uh, there's a rider from Torku who's not following. Valerio Conti's dropped. Actually, that might be important. That could be. That could be crucial. Lukas Postelberger is dropped. Um, okay, we need to watch out for this. Because there might be a first group with about 70 riders that have lost a lot of time. And maybe in that group, there's some important riders for the GC. It's probably some riders important for the sprint, but also for the GC. Right, Navardo Skas is now pacing towards the finish line. I just remember that he's my sprinter, um, well he's gonna launch my sprint for Grozu and not for Fernandez. That's something I need to remember. Alright, Mauro Fineta jumps, jumps in now, a bit late in my opinion. Grozu is just behind him, there goes Edward Grozu, Fernandez can go as well. Grozu, Jakobsen, Restrepo, you're taking the piss right? Edward Michael Grozu! Is, has just won the first stage of the Tour of Turkey for Delco Marseille Provence. Or Delco Marseille Provence, I'm just gonna be as French as I can. What? What? I just didn't see that coming at all. It's. <laughs> I, no, I, I was not expecting that. Uh, Grozu wins from Jakobsen and Sam Bennett, where Strepo takes fourth and Delio Fernandez takes a uh, nice fifth position with Caleb Ewan. Mark Cavendish, Jan Polank, Simone Consoni and Raul Alarcon finishing in the top 10. Uh, Alright, well, we've already got a win. Uh, see you on the podiums. And it's a win for the Romanian champion, Edouard Michel Grosu, the sprinter from Delco Marseille Provence. I didn't think I was going to win it, uh, but he takes his first win in the World Tour. Uh, I think the first win of Delco Marseille in the World Tour, at least. Uh, that's for sure. And he's going to wear this blue jersey, the turquoise, uh, turquoise, yeah, turquoise jersey of leader um, of the presidential cycling tour of Turkey here in Ted in uh, Tedega, no, Tekeda. There we go. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm lost for words. So we're also going to take the points jersey, which I suppose is coming next. Oh no, it's mountain, and it's going to be Morena de Pau from a uh, Sport Vland uh, Baluas, Sport Vlander and Baluas. Yakoventa uh, is second, and we've got Rémi Rocha with uh, one point. Cavendish is uh, 10 seconds behind. Good one. Um, our next is going to be the points jersey of Edouard Michel Grosu, if I'm correct. There we go, 20 points, one point ahead of Fabio Jakobsen. Uh, disappointing sprint from Caleb Ewan and Mark Cavendish, finishing in 6th and 7th position, respectively. Uh, best young rider is Fabio Jakobsen, and best team is going to be ours. Okay, that's, again, didn't think I was going to win it. Didn't think at, at all. Now, is there a gap? There is. 1 minute 18 is the gap. Is there anyone dropped? Uh, okay, so Hood had been dropped. Valerio Conti could be important for the GC. Um, 
you have any get it um in to in toasty no okay shit jeez what happened to you okay it's called davis uh, not really important um eros kapeki lucas postelberger no it's not the one i keep uh, forgetting no uh, making myself confused with um grossartner Morkov has been dropped, Yashpa the boost, but he's useless. Uh, okay, I don't think any any actual leader has been dropped, which is kind kind of disappointing if I have to be honest. Uh, I'd have liked to like uh, if I go just see Boransgrohe, Korshatna is with the best, and um, what was the other one? Diamond Chain Data, Ben O'Connor finished with the best. All right, well that is disappointing, uh, but. That was the first stage of the tour of Turkey. If you enjoyed it, please make sure to leave a like down below. That would really help me out. Also, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Uh, I'm uploading every uh, World Tour stage uh, on the channel. And I'm also doing FIFA. Uh, so yeah, be uh, ready to have the uh, Arden Classic soon on the channel. I've been Blackwall. It's been an absolute pleasure talking to you today, guys. And goodbye.